Hi there, welcome back to my channel. So I'm going to do a project share for you. This is a mini junk journal that I have made recently. Um, I kind of have a goal for myself to work through a lot of these uh, fall papers and Halloween papers that I have just sitting on my desk. So whenever I was doing this collaboration, I pulled out pretty much all the Halloween and fall related paper that I had to kind of work through. And so it's piled up on my desk and I'm trying to work through that little by little. So I did, one of the first things I made was this little miniature junk journal using some of the scraps that I had. And this is a faux leather sunflower cover. I really, really love how it turned out. I think it just, it's darling. I think it just turned out really, really cute. And um, the, I did use little page protectors on these corners. And so I'm just really happy with kind of the overall progress of how it turned out. But anyways, so I'm going to just do a little flip through for you. This does measure about three inches by three inches, kind of two and a half inches. And then it has three signatures that are removable. And we have a total of 60 pages inside or 120 if you count them front and back. So I'm going to just show you what it looks like all the way around. And let's look through. I don't normally do a closure on these, but I did for this one. So it's got some of this uh, just jute type um, twine for the closure. And let's just do a flip through. So this is the first signature. I don't do a ton of decorating inside of this, just so that there's more space for writing and for putting little photos. This is, I did use some nice little pieces of scraps to make a little belly band here and then a little notebook that you can pull out and do extra journaling on. That was a lot of fun to just use the, all the little scraps and different pieces that are on my desk. Which, of course, I still have a ton more, so I'm not sure yet what I'm going to do with what I'm going to do with it. But anyways, these are some little journaling spots, so they actually unfold completely so you can journal inside of them. And there's a little piece of Velcro that's just holding these closed. So I tried to make that a little bit of an interactive page. And then here we have... Um, we have a pocket over here that has some things tucked inside, but then also there is a little tiny magnet in here and this is more journaling space. So this can fold up and you could journal on those parts and then there's a the little magnet that just holds it there. This is just a little, one of those tool paper clips that I love to make and it just holds this piece down. There we go. Here we have another pocket, which is some stickers and some little things to journal with tucked inside. All right. And then this one, this is the second signature. And here we have, this one is an actual envelope, so this one doesn't unfold all the way, but it does have a little card in there for you to journal on. And then this also is like a little belly band for that tag. And the tag says create. This is a printable from My Porch Prints. I absolutely love all of her um, junk journal printables. And that's one of her labels ones. I'm not sure what it's exactly called. It's been a long time since I bought that. Little paper clip I made. And this folds out like this. And that's just kind of holding that in place. Just some little ephemer pieces. This is Oh My, It's Time for Pie. That is a ephemer piece from uh, Echo Park. I love tiny junk journals. I just, they're so cute. I love them so much. All right, this is an interactive piece. Um, and it just, you can slide these up and you could journal on those and then tuck it all back into its space. And oh, that was, again, that was another idea I had just from using up some little pieces of scraps that I had from previous projects using this paper. And the same thing with this. I wanted to use up some, I had a little tiny piece of vellum and some different things that I wanted to use up. And we've just got some tags. And then the, the back piece is also a pocket with a tag inside. There's that, and I like this to hang up so that the top of that isn't bulky inside the pages. All right. Right here, we have another little 
corner pocket with a little um, round tag tucked in and then also there's a piece of velcro that can close that and it's a hidden journaling spot and I believe that's it right here just another another little clip dangle I made using a little pom-pom okay so there's that um, but anyways, yeah, that's my flip through of the little micro junk journal that I have available in my shop. I will have the link for it down in the description box. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Take care.